up guys, it's Frank here from AFTV Young Girls. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we have something very different for the channel. As you can see, I've got a headset on, and I'm not in an Arsenal shirt, most importantly. Yes, I'm in an England shirt. No, I'm not proud of it, but today, as I said, start of a brand new series, and yes, it's going to be involved around FIFA 18 on the PS4, and we're going to be doing a England 2018 Road to World Cup. Well, I say it's called World to Road to World Cup, but it's basically me playing the World Cup of FIFA 18. What I've done is I've made this squad as realistic as I possibly could. The only one mistake I have made is Daniel Sturridge in this team. Uh, obviously, he wouldn't be in my starting eleven for the World Cup this year. Uh, but I accidentally left him in. So, anyone that doesn't like Daniel Sturridge, you're going to have to forgive me. And another problem is it's basically full of Tottenham players. Because Tottenham English players happen to be quite good. We've got the likes of Harry Kane, Danny Rose, Kyle Walker. No, what? Kyle Walker's not even a Tottenham player anymore. What am I talking about? And Eric Dyer. Okay, so it's time for me to take you through the 24-man squad, I think it is. How many is it? 11, uh, math time, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. 23 man squad should I say okay so for the starting 11 in goal of course Jack Butland in my opinion is England's best goalkeeper right now and if Jack Butland's England's best goalkeeper that is the sign of the times for us isn't it right back Kyle Walker the two centre backs are going to be Eric Dyer and Phil Jones left back of course has to be Danny Rose uh, our two centre midfielders are Jack Wilshire and Jordan Henderson and of course Jordan Henderson should be England captain but he's not not on my watch Jack Wilshire is going to be the England captain for the 2018 World Cup if it has anything to do with me attacking mid oh, here we go of course we got have to we have to go with Dele Alli um, not pretty happy, too happy about it, but it had to happen. Uh, left mid, we're going with Marcus Rashford. Right wing, Raheem Sterling. And then up top, once again, didn't want to do it, but it has to be Harry Kane. Let's take you onto the bench now. Jordan Pickford, of course. Our goalkeeper is absolutely terrible going into this World Cup, isn't, it, isn't they? I mean, on FIFA, they look good. But not in real life. Uh, our backup right, pick is, right back is Nathaniel Klein. Now, I've only got one more centre-back. I didn't mean to do this as Eva. Um, we've got Harry Maguire, of course, the Leicester centre-back. Uh, Mr. Dabman and Millie Rock himself. Jesse Lingard. Ross Barkley is going to be in there also. I don't know why I've put him in. That's another mistake. Oxlade, Chamberlain, our good friend the Ox, of course, has to be in there, unfortunately. Jamie Vardy was always going to be in there. Nick Pope is our third choice goalkeeper. Ryan Bertrand, Kieran Trippier. Uh, my old friend, Theo Walcott. And then finally, and accidentally, Daniel Sturridge. So the way this series is going to work is I'm going to try and get as far as I can in this World Cup campaign. Uh, our group, of course, is England, Switzerland, Northern Ireland and Cameroon. Now, a lot of the teams that are actually in the World Cup are not in this game. And a lot of teams that didn't qualify are, of course, in FIFA 18. So this is not going to be realistic, I don't think, in any way. Uh, but we've got a pretty strong, we've got a pretty decent group for us there. A group F that consists of Hungary, Germany, United States and Ivory Coast. Group G, Spain, Czech Republic, Australia and Egypt. Brazil, Netherlands, Ireland and South Africa. Africa, that is an interesting group. Next is Belgium, Chile, Poland and Russia. Again, another interesting group. Uh, Belgium and Chile already picking up wins. Uh, France, Uruguay, Greece and Canada. Italy, Colombia, Scotland and Saudi Arabia. Argentina, Portugal, New Zealand and Turkey. And that is all the groups. So realistically we should be able to get out of our group easily and our group does kick off with a game against our UK rivals Northern Ireland now I'm going to be going with a full strength team if we end up battering them I'm going to of course make some changes throughout the game then I'm going to keep switching around the squad throughout the tournament and hopefully I should be able to keep fans of all teams happy now if your player doesn't get used I'm sorry but I'm the manager here let's do this
Harry Kane's ready, and so am I. England, let's do something. Raheem Sterling. Ah, oh, Raheem Sterling's through. Inside. Jordan Henderson is not going to get to it, though. We've got an early corner. That's a great start from England. And hopefully we can get something from this corner. And no, Harry Kane is not taking corners. Marcus Rashford is. Let's get a good whip on it. Deli Alley! Straight into the hands of Camp. Super, super Jack, super Jackie Wilshire. Deli Alley. Outside, Deli. Wow, Deli. Wow. It's a great ball from Jack Wilshire. To Rashford. Marcus Rashford's in, cut inside, Marcus Rashford, 1-0 to England, and Marcus Rashford kicks off England's goal scoring account with a fantastic goal against Northern Ireland, I think it's a Harry Kane assist unfortunately for us, but it doesn't matter, we've scored a fairly early goal, and it was a good goal, and I'm really happy about that, come on England, Deli Ali go for the shot, Deli Ali. that's another absolutely skied shot from the waste man himself. Get it clear, get it clear, get it clear. Well done. Great defending. Right, Raheem Sterling's through now. Right, I can sense a 2 0. Go on, Raheem. Inside. Inside. Cut it in. Oh, nearly to Harry Kane's feet. That was a great run from Raheem Sterling, though. Harry Kane turns. And it's another save from the Northern Ireland goalkeeper. No, 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 no. Oh, my God. That was a great shot from Lafferty. I got a bit lucky there. He should have taken it more forward. But that was terrible defending on my behalf. I apologise. No, no. Do not let Chris Brunt get it in, Eric. All right, just clear it. Well done, Kyle Walker. Lafferty, again, cannot get it past. And Jack Walsh can run here. He's got support. No, ref's not going to give us enough time to let Jack Walsh do something in this game. It's half time and we're currently winning one goal to nil thanks to a fantastic goal, can I say, from Marcus Rashford. He kicks off England's World Cup with a bang against Northern Ireland. And you know what? Maybe it should be more than one nil and they should have probably scored. But right now I'm happy to take a one nil win and hopefully we can increase that lead in the second half. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Come on, Deli Ali. Inside, back inside. Deli Ali, still going. Deli Ali, Deli Ali, inside. Deli Ali, oh, that is a fantastic. No, 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 it wasn't. No, it wasn't. That was a terrible goal from Deli Ali. Really, really lucky. Oh, what am I kidding? It was a fantastic solo goal from Deli Ali. We've got to give him that one. England 2, Northern Ireland 0. I think England have got this in the bag now. Look at this. Pass 1, pass 2, pass 3, and then that was a cheeky, cheeky finish near post that was terrible goalkeeping but I don't mind I'm gonna make some substitutions now no one's tired but I just want to make everyone feel welcome um do you know what as much as it pains me to do let's give Alex Oxley Chamberlain a run out uh, not in his natural position of centre mid apparently and let's give let's give Ross Bartley a go here we go for number 31 Alex Oxley Chamberlain and for number 8 Ross Bartley do you know what I really shouldn't have put Ross Bartley in this team because he doesn't deserve to go, but I've done it now. I can't turn back. I didn't want it to Harry Kane. Oh, it's worked. Deli Alley. Turn him. Oxley Chamberlain back inside. Great play. Great. Oh, that would have been a perfect goal. Harry Kane still going. That would have been a great goal if I scored that. It's Chamberlain. Into Kyle Walker. Use your pace to get forward. Turn back. Whip it. Rashford looking for the second and couldn't get it. Barkley, oh, took a deflection, and I'm going to take a corner for that. No, that's poor. That is poor from me, and they've made me pay for it. Northern Ireland have scored, and I think that might be. Yes, of course it is. Will Grigg is on fire and has kicked off his World Cup goals. With that one, and it was, again, I'm going to blame myself for that one. I tried to do unnecessary skill moves, and they made me pay for it, so now I need to be careful. Harry Kane turn again. Finesse. Harry Kane still cannot score. It's getting on my nerves now, actually, because he's meant to be the best striker in England, and he's not even scoring. Come on, Kyle Walker. Raheem Sterling. That's Oxley Chamberlain, sorry. 
Marcus Rashford looking for his second goal and that was a terrible header. Just to be sure we're better at the back, I'm going to be bringing on a fit defender. He's not the fastest, but he's definitely fit. Harry Maguire. Harry Kane, chance to finish it off. Harry Kane and couldn't finish it. Oh, I should have just squared it to the person next to him. I've got one more chance to score a goal, I think. And can we take it? Marcus Rashford corner. Harry Maguire's in there to substitute. And nearly scored. But it doesn't matter now because it's full time. And we have won our first game in the World Cup of 2018. 2-1 against Northern Ireland. Thanks to goals from Marcus Rashford and, of course, Dele Alli. To pick us up the three points, let's check the table. Okay, so this is how the table is looking after this game. Of course, we won 2 1, so we're at the top with three points. Switzerland and Cameroon drew, and Ireland are down there with a loss on zero points. Okay, so in the next episode, we're going to be going up against Cameroon. That's how it's going to work. There's going to be one game per episode to make this as long as possible. Now, if you remember, I wasn't born, but some of you older subscribers might, might remember. I've got a good family friend who might remember as well, Italia90. Uh, England versus Cameroon. The, ma the man I'm talking about is, of course, Paul Parker, close family friend, great guy, uh, and he was in that game. And uh, they, uh, England really underestimated Cameroon, and they almost made them pay for it if it wasn't for goals from Gary Lineker. But we're, I'm not going to be doing that. I'm not going to be underestimating them. I believe they may have Samuel Eto, so I'm going to watch out for him. Thank you for watching this video, guys. If you liked it, make sure to leave a like or subscribe to AFTV Young Guns. I will see you guys next time. Peace. Thank you.